Sometimes fame and success can change people, but not Ryan Palmer. He's got a lot of character. He's got a great sense of humor. He's just as good a friend off the course as he was 30 years ago. That commitment to those close to him was on display just over a year ago at the 2013 Players. We showed up Wednesday last year, no expectations, and started shooting 500 on Thursday. It was a good start, and of course, came the bad news that night when I found out about a close friend of mine that I grew up with and still stay in contact with who passed away in a car accident that day. Clay Adderholt, a childhood friend of Ryan's, was just 36 years of age. He and Ryan were like brothers. I would call it more of a brotherhood than I would a friendship. That turned into a hard week, talking to you know, my wife, friends of ours together, um, his wife, and uh, it became a very, very emotional week for sure. In spite of his personal pain, Palmer remained at TPC Sawgrass to continue the tournament and honor Clay with a symbolic gesture, putting his initials CA on his hat for the remainder of the week. But Palmer's tribute also included inspired play on the golf course. Ryan Palmer moves it to 11 under par, two off the lead. It was no shocker to us that he was gonna do well that week. Yeah, he had a heavy heart, but you know, at the same time, he knew he had to go out there and take care of business. And, you know, with as close as they were, as good a guy as Clay was, family man, athlete, father, he was right there with him every step of the way. Once I got inside the ropes, I just kind of just, I put everything aside for those five hours and kept to myself all the next three days. Didn't talk much. You know, I walked real slow and just tried to pace myself and, you know, thought about Clay the whole time. I think it just gave me a sense of, calmness, you knowing it's just play golf, and then after that, you know, we can, you know, we'll deal with the grief. Palmer finished tied for fifth, his only top 50 finish in nine career starts at the Players. And after his final putt on 18, the emotions came to the surface. That's kind of when it all came out, and, you know, I'm going to go spend a few good days with some friends and, you know, remember Clay. I honestly don't know how this 36-year-old kept it together after he lost his friend earlier in the week. He said it was really an escape to get on the golf course, get his mind off of that. You know, I'd say he helped me get through a, a lot this week to get through the last three rounds. You know, I'm pretty proud of the way I hung in there. I was strong mentally and just really focused. That was the best way I thought I could pay tribute to Clay and his family, and, um, you know, it turned into a pretty cool story.